Hey guys, Harry here, and the reason why um, I made this video is because I found out how to fix um a Chromebox. Yeah, you may mention uh, my yesterday's fist video, and um, now um, I finally figured out how to get updates from my end of light Chromebox. Let's do it. And I realized that um. There is two USB ports and um, number two S two USB ports. How stupid am I? So um, I I'm still connected to the keyboard and a mouse, and um, there's a flash drive in the other one. So I just realized that I just discovered that this computer has four um USB ports, like my main computer right over there. And um, yeah, right now it is creating a recovery image. I'm trying this again, and I got the um, I got the um, the article of I fix it by Kevin Purdy, and um, I'm using it on my laptop. So yeah, I'll see you guys when um the recovery image is is done, and I have to go back to school tomorrow. Crap. And also, I need to take a part of my Chrome box to remove the white protection. And now I figure out how to do it by a video. And I also um figure out how to enter recovery mode by Chrome box and realize I did the Chromebook method. How stupid am I? So I had to um find a a reset button um. Yeah, a recovery button, reset button to enable recovery mode. And the reset button is right over there. So I need to use um a paper clip to enable that. So that's how the method works. And I know where the white protection is. It's right over there. And oh oop. Oh the right protection there. And this guy is from um LON.tv. And this screw right over there um is the white protection so thanks lon dot tv for showing me how, where the white protection is and yes this is a hp chrome box all right so recovering media it's officially ready so now i get to shut down my computer all right so i need to remove my chrome box white protection i don't know why it says chromebook so i know where the white protection is so um i got my screwdriver and i'm just gonna start screwing it up and i'll see you guys back here all right guys so i got the screws removed and the screws is um on top of my laptop so let's open it up and see what's inside Ooh, look at that all right so um there's the um there's a Wi-Fi port, and this is the RAM, I think. So now I need to take part of some things uh, and remove that metal part. So I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I removed these um these screws, and these screws are in there. So um, and I also removed that thingy. I don't know what it is, but hopefully it's not the wires because I'm worried. So let's pop it up. And whoa, look at that thing. And there's the white protection I need to be released. So um, so let me give you some instructions. There is the Wi-Fi um, cord, and this is the thingy, I don't know. And this is the RAM. So the RAM is whatever it is, and there's HB Chrome box over there. Oh my god, I can't believe I removed these parts. So I don't want to take down the all parts, but um yeah, um, so right there, as I mentioned uh, from the video, that is the, um, the white protection thing that I need to remove that thing. So let's go ahead and remove it. Kind of nervous removing this. All right, so removing that. All right, so I remove this thing. I can't believe I'm like a computer expert. There we go. So I officially removed that part. So now I don't know where it goes. So yeah. All right. Now since um the white protection is removed, we can now put this thing back together. I'll be right back. This is gonna take me a long time. Done. And yes, I tested and it still works. But where am I gonna leave this screw? Hmm. I can leave it under um the Wilmington Blue Rock hat. So in case I don't lose it. There. Now it's safe and sound. Step three. 
Enable recovery mode and develop mode. With wipe protect disable, it's time to dig deep into your Chrome box. Not Chrome book, Chrome box. All right, so um, now I have to um, use a paper clip and hold the recovery button. So let me do that. Okay, so I see this scary message according to what the article says. <laughs> and it says, Chrome OS is missing or damaged. Please insert the recovery USB stick or SB card by Chrome OS recovery model, this number and these things. So now I had to press um this and this key to enable um developer mode. And um yes, I said um Yes, I, I'm not a developer, but yeah, um You'll get a screen asking if you disable um to write yourself and yet yeah, verification's off press all right hold yeah okay so i'll just all right this and that all right turn verification off press recovery and oh i have to press the recovery button again so um press enter all right so um Okay, let me do this. Whoa, guys, if I press enter, it will beep. Now, that's pretty cool. Okay, so I press OS for notification is off. So now I need to um, press hold this, this key and it's like, it's just, I'm a developer, it's okay. It's good, because we're hacking this firmware. Huh? Oh, okay, all right, so Siri and D. Whoa. Oh, whoa, 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 what the heck? Not my computer. Um, your system is translation to development mode. Local data is being cleared. All right, so, all right, so, um, I have to wait. I'll be right back. Preparing system from developer mode. This may take a while. Do not turn your computer off until it has restarted. All right, so it's gonna take a while. I'll see you guys when it translated to developer mode. Okay, so I enabled developer mode and it, the ver OS verification is still off, so I guess I'll just... Oh, okay, so I guess I'll press enter to do this. Enter, oh, press space. Oh, I'm such an idiot. So, um, press confirm when you wish and turn off. All right, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, press enter. Okay. Yay! System will reboot and local um, data will be um, cleared. Alright, so um, it will boot up to developer mode. And uh, yeah, according to this, it didn't say, um, oh, system last boot. What does that say? Hmm, I guess I'll look back. Oh my goodness, look, it says Chrome. All right, so I guess to enable developer mode, I think. Welcome, all right, yay. So now I need to, um, yeah, system scream. Um, yeah, so I had to, and yeah. Guys, bad news, um, um, it returned to normal mode and, right, I screwed this up. So now I have to process that again. Okay guys, so it led me to the same again. So what happens if I press this key? Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, I press. Oh my goodness, I forgot that step again. Hey. Oh, enable debugging features. Nah, nah, I don't care. Okay, so I followed the steps over there, and um, yeah. Fres, you'll flash through the dark screen, but we'll only be here in a few minutes. Oh my god, I need to hurry. Oh my god, okay, hurry. Hold up, I need to type this. Okay, so I typed that following convention, um, oh, command, and gotta press enter. Subscribe. What's this? Alright, so I know the terminal. I need to hurry and have fun, and yeah. Oh, what's happening? What? What? Enable, uh... Okay, hold on. Alright guys, so I figured out the problem that uh, I need to type in the password from um, the Chromium OS. So, um, hold up, let me check. So you need to um, type the login as root and then type in test 0 and yeah, you logged in, so yeah. But guess what? White protection is disabled. There it is. There it is. All right. So um, now I need to press number two. 
All right, number two, let's go number two. All right, so um, dinner disc light. Um, script will do this say one more time. All right, um, remove your ability, uh, yes. All right, so it's loading. Okay, uh, come on. In a second. I'm so stupid. I had to type the capital Y, but after flashing, you need to install OS. New Rumble. You did. Alright, so yes. Press. Yeah, I want to continue. Right back here, it was be, um. Uh. Stuck. Run. Hmm. No. Wait. No, I don't want to. No, I don't want to. All right. Downloading full wrong borrowware. All right. It's gonna take a long time. All right. So next, I'm gonna do um. When it's done, enter P, P, and hit enter. All right. So all right, hit P. And enter. All right, powering off. There we go. And my Chromebook's no longer special. Yay! All right, so it's powered off, and now we get to unplug um, in the Cloud Ready USB stick. All right, so um, I just gotta plug it in. Like plugging it in. There we go plugged in and we got to turn on the power all right so um coming up all right so it so it showed up the bunny and um yeah mm, press the escape key oh my god or oh, escape key all right escape key all right escape key Boot operating settings. I pressed escape key. Come on. Oh my god, why? Press escape key. Hold up. Oh, there it is. Cloud ready. Alright, so we'll boot up for a sec. Alright. Alright, so um it will tell me to welcome. So um let's click uh come on. Uh, where's my mouse? Uh, where's my mouse? Hold up. Alright, so I found my mouse. Let's click let go. Let's go. And I gotta log into my password. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. Alright, click continue. Oh, click continue. What? Alright, there we go. Alright, it's gonna say it's please wait. Oh, gotta sign in. Hold up. Okay, so it's waiting. And um, there's OS version 85. Yeah. That's, I don't want any more end of support. All right. All right, I'm ready to start using my Chrome device. Yay, all right. Ooh. All right, get started. Whoa, thanks for using Cloud Ready Home Edition. Yay. All right, so how do I install it? Let's see. All right, you can click on the settings. Oh, all right, I'm gonna install Chrome OS. Wait, what? Why is it slow? Ah, uh, there we go. All right, how do I install Chrome OS? How do I do it? Install OS, that's what I needed. All right, I have to update, up to date, yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, great hard drive and um, it will install it. And it will boot up to, um, like the original Chrome OS. And now I got the official updates. Well, yeah. I mean, oh, it's still updating. All right. Thank you guys for watching. I got to go set up to my new, um, Chromebox. See ya.